everyone, I'm Sarah. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome to my channel if you're new here. Today is a haul. I'm so excited to film this video because I've been waiting to film this video for a hot minute. This is the $5.95 Body Care Day sale with also a $5.50 um, body care day sale kind of um so I didn't post this on my Instagram yet so this is the first you'll get you guys will get this first usually I post on Instagram first but I'm posting here first so that's exciting if you're not ready I would check out my bath waters Instagram since I post like I said usually I post first on there about hauls and stuff so I would check that out as well as my personal Instagram but today we're doing a haul and I'm super excited like I said because I got this I did the haul it was before Easter um so it was like a hot minute ago when they had this the, the package took forever to come in and I feel like everyone got their package around the same time and then they do a 550 sale I feel like that's a little suspicious Bath and Body Works but at that point I should have just done a pickup in store because it took forever I didn't think it would take that long but it took forever so we're gonna get to the haul I don't have the box I do but it's not in the box anymore so we're just gonna do the haul the first thing I got was a lotion so I have body butters I think I only have one right now I usually only have one at a time I'm gonna start using or buying the tree hut ones because I don't use scrubs but I heard the body butters tree hut body butters are pretty good and they smell really good so I will try those out next time but I got this lotion I did hear mixed reviews about lotions because it's like a lot of people don't like the lotions so I kind of heard that after I bought this honestly but we'll see how it goes I don't usually use these um like the body butters until like after I shave after the shower um and usually that's at nighttime so I don't know maybe I'll use it during the day in the summer to like have a glow but we'll see how glittery it is um I love the scent pure wonder it's probably my favorite scent right now in the signature line ah it smells really good. I mean, it looks glittery. You guys can't really tell, but oh, I just love that scent. So yeah, I got the lotion for this because they did not have the regular body butter. And I here on body care day sales, um, one thing I tried not to get was like any of the things that are going to go 75 to 50% off at SAS because like the scents that don't usually go on sale at SAS are what you should get on body care days, um, especially like the lotions and their signature line or the body butters, blah, blah, blah. Uh, cause Pure Wonder really doesn't go on sale. So when it's on like an all sale, I usually try to do those. So I get like the, the things that you don't usually see on sale, if that makes sense. So yeah, I got the Pure Wonder. This is originally twenty fifty, and I got it for five ninety five. So that's a great deal, regardless if I like it or not. So we'll see how this goes. I am excited to try that out, but I know people say it's not the best. So we'll see how it goes. Okay. So the next thing I got. Oh my god, I just have to put them out here because I have them there one second so the next thing i got was the uh black chamomile sleep so this one i have now and i kind of regret getting the shower gel i should have gotten the lotion so next time they do have a body care sale i will definitely be getting in the lotion for this since i already have a shower gel it's new packaging so i have the one from two years ago i think um and this one is just a black chamomile sleep uh this is the only aromatherapy scent i like i know there's other ones that i might like but I've only really liked this one before bed. It smells really good. And yeah, I just like, really like that. Yeah, so I thought it was cute. So this one is usually $14.50, another one for $5.95. And yes, yeah, so I got that one. And then the next one I got, so I was kind of pissed off when I got this in the mail because this one had leaked and I was really pissed off because it's like, you know, it gets a little sticky. So I can't open the cap. It's not really fun to open the cap. I tried like clearing it off, but it's yeah, it's gross so this is you're the one i don't have the shower gel you're the one so i wanted to get the shower gel you're the one and ugh, such a good scent i usually can't smell these like through here but this one's fine since it leaked but yeah this is a really good one. Oh, let me read the scent notes for you guys because like some people like read the sentence all the time and i feel bad that i don't so pure wonder i'll read them in a second because i got another thing in pure wonder so the scent notes on black chamomile are Camel oil and bergamot oil. Is that it? I mean, I guess it's the aromatherapy, so that makes sense. But yeah, I mean, it's a black camel. I don't know. But like the scent notes on You're the One are white birch, velvety rose, and a drop of strawberry nectar. It's very perfumey scent. I really enjoy it. Um, 
it's definitely a hit or miss. I feel like a lot of their scents, their signature scents, like Pure Wonder, Japanese Cherry Blossom, you're the one, you know, A Thousand Wishes, Stars, like, I feel like, um, either you like them or dislike them, and also everyone's nose is different, but I'm a big fan of you're the one. So I got this in, I have now this in a shower gel, lotion, and fine for so I'm very happy with my set. Um, all right, so then the next one, I did get a lotion in Pure Wonder, and, um, yeah, I wanted to, I should have gotten a shower gel, but I don't have a lotion in it, so I wanted to get a lotion. This is the only faucet collection I like. I don't like any other faucet. So the scent notes, why don't they have the scent notes on this? That's weird. It's iced rosé, star jasmine, and warm white amber. I don't know why they're not on there. That's weird. So yeah, Pure Wonder, super good. I love this one, like I said. It's one of my favorites now. Okay, I have a set now. Um, so yeah. Uh, next scent that I got for the five ninety five is the only one that probably will go on sale for SAF, which is Buttercups and Berry Bellini. I got this. I smelled it. I didn't smell it. I bought it before I even smelled it, and then the week later I smelled it in the store. I was waiting for it to come on, not come in my hall, so I can smell it for you guys on, like, in person. But that didn't happen. So, so this one is really good. I read online that someone said that it reminds them of Paris Some More and the strawberry soda from last year. I don't know. It's got a unique scent to it. Uh, it is strawberry puree, buttercup flowers, and bubbly prosecco. I don't know. It does definitely smells like a bubbly strawberry soda, but not strawberry soda. So maybe that's why. Um, packaging. I really like this. It's so cute. This is the only one I liked in the new collection. I've been really sad with the new collections lately at Bath and Body Works. I just haven't like really liked the new stuff um yeah so i hope sas is okay like i just don't see myself going all out unless they did like last year where they brought out a ton of scents at sas and that's when i mostly got because i've been really disappointed oh also i did a mini haul that i was gonna have in this haul like a mini sale haul that i did i think it was a couple days after i ordered this haul but i brought those things home and i'm sad about it but i'll insert a picture right here so i got a gingham love mini shower gel i got a pineapple the pink pineapple shower gel and i got the whip mary marine lotion and then uh, now i don't have this pictured but i did get um buttercups um and berry bellini and the hand cream so um for these ones i don't really like the pink pineapple one or gingham love that much they are good but i got them in travel size to see if i really do like it um and usually i like doing that because you know i don't like upset that much but i like you know, we'll use it on the travel or like when I travel. So usually I do that. So that's why I got those two. Um, and then I really liked Whitberry Murray anyway. So yeah. Okay. So the next things that I got, I went to do the 550 sale. So I really wanted to get a shower gel in Pure Wonder at the 550 sale, but my store didn't have it, which is depressing. So I will get that at the next sale or my free item because since I just said that Bath Barks has not posted or not like brought out anything that I'm absolutely in love with that might mean I get the Pure Wonder Shower Gel. So I ended up getting the Strawberry Pound Cake a lotion because I did want this in my collection. I don't like the Fawcett collection. I just like, why am I paying more for you to put this on my bottle? Like I just, I know that people do like um, more elegant packaging like this and I understand that, but like, I do like that they're also bringing out two different kinds, but that's like just more money. I don't know. I don't know. It's preference, of course, because I do like the fun packaging like this, but I see where they're going with, you know, elegant packaging. It's kind of a debate, I know, but um, yeah, I mean, I got it because they don't have anything. They didn't have anything I really wanted else. So this one obviously is a good scent. I love strawberry pound cake and it's so good. Um, just disappointed that I didn't get my Pure Wonder shower gel, but it's okay. Um, and then the last thing I got was for my boyfriend that he picked out himself, which is the breath, the fresh water. This is a new one for the men's collection. And I honestly really like it. Usually all the men's stuff smell the same. Like right now he has teakwood and stone. And they're pretty similar. They're not exactly the same. I made sure they're not the same. Um, but this one is really different. This one. Oh, I didn't read the notes of... I mean, do you guys really know? I think all the faucet don't have, have any... That's weird, they don't have any scent notes on them. Okay, well, fragrance notes on fresh water are Italian bergamot, mountain spring water, and oak moss. Oak moss. <laughs> so, this one's really good. I really like this one. It's not as very, like, strong cologne scent. So if you're not really into those, like, really strong ones, I recommend this one a lot. So yeah, he picked that out himself, and I was like, oh, 
yay so that is my haul for you guys i will say now um i will not be posting an empties video in the month of april because i have like one product from bath and finished and like one thing that wasn't bath and Waterworks. so i sadly have not been finishing a lot of things lately i've been trying to use my stuff but i just haven't finished anything because usually like all the stuff i started in march was brand new so that's kind of why i don't have anything right now so my may empties will be april and may so stay tuned for that in the month um but i will have more videos soon um like i said in my last video i'll have like a lot of videos this summer like collection videos but also hauls i'm really excited i haven't posted a haul just because oh, i'm broke but i also don't have money so I mean, that's the same thing i'm broke but i also haven't liked the sense is what i was trying to say so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video i'm wearing a really cute shirt i want to show you guys it's from a small business in lawrence kansas and it says walk massachusetts street and it says downtown lawrence um yeah i thought it was cute and it was designed by someone there. So yeah, I really wanted to show you guys that. And I tried out a new hairstyle again. I've been really liking this one. I know it's really basic and not new, but thin hair can't really do much. So we do what we can, you know? But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you in my next video. Um, Bye.